Okay. Uh, here we are back with Teach Them Live again um, uh, with our practice question of the day, um, which is a carryover from the, the last couple videos. The first metacarpal bone is located in the wrist. Uh, same scenario that we were talking about before. Um, scatter plot below shows relationship, all right, for nine people. Based on the line of best fit, what is the predicted height for someone with a first metacarpal bone that has length of 4.45 centimeters? Well, so what, you know, first you're thinking, okay, wait a sec, I don't even have an equation here. What am I, what am I supposed to do? Um, let's see if I can zoom in on this. So I'm going to see if I can take off the draw feature so I can zoom in a bit and get a better look at this. And now we'll see if we can mark on it. Okay, so 4.45. Each of these goes in increments of 0.05. So 4.45 would be right about here. So they want me to go up to this line and then carry it over and look at what value is right there. Now each of these marks on the y-axis looks like it's going up by 1. So I'm thinking that looks like it's about at 169. So 4.45 according to the line predicted, whoa, come on, predicted 169. So that's going to be my answer to this question is choice B. Um, there's no equation that I need to plug anything into. Uh, you know, they didn't give that to me, so I don't need to try to get all magical and come up with an equation and blah, blah, blah. I just need to use the graph. And since they were nice enough to give me, they didn't give me some crazy number like 4.48 and make me guess, you know. I mean, I could do stuff like that, you know, but... You know, and if that's what they do, then that's what they do, and I got to choose between the answer choices listed. But it looks like they were pretty nice to me. So anyway, that's our problem for the day. Uh, go to uh, teachthemlive. Uh, dot com and you know send that link to your friends to sign up for the practice question of the day, and I'll be happy to get people on my email list. We post things on Facebook at Teach Them Live, as well as Pinterest and. Uh, Oh, YouTube as well. So you can see these videos there as well. Uh, subscribe, like, and uh, then sign up for my class so that you can get a lot more of this type of stuff. Talk to you soon.